Today I'm going to show you how to charge your Shimano Di2 battery. So right here is your charging port. So what you're going to need to charge it is you're going to need the Shimano charger SM-BCR2 charger on one end has the Shimano special Shimano connector on it. So the other side of the charger is just a uh, micro USB connector. Then you want to plug the USB into either a computer, uh, like a standard charging block like this, or a higher uh, power block like this. This puts out 10 watts. This is going to charge your DI2 battery a lot quicker. This will work fine. It'll take a little bit longer. And if you plug it into a computer, it's going to take um, even longer yet due to the power output. So when you plug it in, the charger is going to have an orange light under the charge icon right here. Uh, but when the charge is over, that light's going to go out and your Shimano Di2 battery will be fully charged at that point. So in order to determine how much charge is on your Di2 battery, we want to look at the left hand icon right here. There's an LED on the left side, there's a little battery symbol right here. So all you need to do is press any of your shift levers for about a half a second and that light is going to come on. After it comes on for two seconds, the both lights are going to flash or do something else. That has to do with your shift mode, uh, which I talk about in a different video. But all we're worried about is this light for about two seconds after you hit your shift switch. So you push your shifter, comes on solid green. That means we're between 75% and 100%. If it's flashing green, it's uh, 50, 50 to 75%. If it's red, it's 25 to 50%. And if it's flashing red, it's just about dead. So you want to get it charged if it comes up red. So the actual Shimano Di2 battery is located in different areas depending on the bike that you have. I have a, a Trek Damani. And on this particular Trek, the Di2 battery is in the hidden compartment in here. So this is actually the end of the battery. It's a long tube like structure, but it's right down in here. So that's actually the battery that we're charging where it's located. Depending on the bike that you have, your battery might be located in the seat tube where you'll have to take the seat off or the seat post out to get to the battery. Those are the two different types that I know about. There might be others in there, but just so you know, the battery is usually internally mounted on some bikes and it could be externally mounted on some bikes as well. All right, if you like this video, please hit like below and please subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching.